Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today's video I am doing what's in our carry-on bag. So this is, um, we've got four carry-on bags. We've got one each for the boys. We've got a changer bag, which is going to be Jack's because he doesn't really take carry-on. And then my carry-on bag, I thought I'd stick it all in one video rather than doing two or three different videos. They'll be easier. So yeah, I'll jump straight in. There is a few things I need to get extra. Um, like for the boys, I still need to get... Um, it's going to focus. So yeah, for the boys, I still need to get um, a few things like snacks and bottles um, for them to drink. But yeah, basically for the boys, they've both got exactly the same. They've both got a pair of headphones. These are just really cheap ones off eBay. They did say they had the volume limit for the kids. Um, and I have tested them myself and they seem all right. I don't think they're going to last many years, but I'm not sure even if they'd like them. I just didn't want to fork out a lot of money and pay for them. Then they've got their Kindles, um, so Amazon tablets, which they're like the actual kids' ones. So I'll load up all of their games, all of their episodes, movies, things like that. Um, and then as for toys, we've got their Batman figurine, which they love, a bag of Lego, and then I've taken a couple of cars and a couple of Paw Patrol figures that Ollie loves to play with. Um, and then for colouring books, it's actually one of my colouring books, I've got my colouring book, a little pack of pencils because I have got pens. Um, and for some reason they love these little books. They've got some bigger books and packed in the suitcase for night times, but they've got these. And then because it's near Christmas, I've got them these little Christmas wish books, which is all about Oliver. And then their bags. So we normally take trunkies away, but because trunkies are so big and obviously huge, I don't think it'd be much point because... They end up just going in the overhead locker and that's it. So yeah, exactly the same for Charlie's. This is the change of bag which Jack will carry. Um, and it's sort of a mix of the boys and mine. So it's got my eyeshadow palettes in. I don't pack these in my suitcase. Because obviously you see how much suitcases get chucked around. And they're worth a lot of money. It's done them broken. Um, I've got the boys hats for when we land. We've got a couple of spare dummies because the kids do love dummies. They will be giving them up to Father Christmas soon. Um, a big pack of wipes. For this bag, I still need to get a bottle for me for my water. I want them little Rob Robinsons fruit squash thingies, the ones that are like that big that you can actually take through to the airport. Um, and I've got a bag of pens. They're actually my pens, but the boys will use them. My colouring book, because I do like to colour. And then a shopping list game, which the boys absolutely love. I thought I'd put it in here rather than their bag, because otherwise it would be sprayed out everywhere. Um, and that would take that in our yummy mummy changing bag and then as for my bag the only thing I need to put in here still is my MacBook and obviously the camera and my phone so for me I've got a pair of fluffy socks I can't fly without them I've got this little wallet which is actually really handy and um, I've got this off Amazon actually and I think it was like six six or seven pound but it literally holds everything in so it's got pens in it's got passports um, it's got a space to put all of your euros when we get them changed up. It's got our tickets in, all of our information of our insurance and hotel things. It's got a back pocket here, which has got um, my marriage certificate in. The reason I take that is because my medicine, I fly as Janoki, but I'm Fidox. My medicine says Fidox. So if they were aware of it to, you know, say what's going on, I can show them that I've been married. So yeah, I've got my inhaler. We also use it for the boys as well because I've got asthma. I've got my notebook. This is while I'm away, obviously taking notes for filming and things. Um, I've got a power bank, which I will charge up for the boys in case any of the stuff dies. Obviously it might not, but my phone will probably die because four hours is a long time for my phone, it's quite old. Um, I've got my little tripod, my handheld one, my stabiliser. I've got my hard drive because I'll either be editing videos or I'll be watching films on my MacBook. I've um, got my headphone for that exact reason, they're not wireless, I wish they were. And then I've got this little bag which I'll be taking um, important electrical items in, so like my memory cards for filming while we're in the air and arriving. Um, wires for obviously attaching the power bank to. And then this will all be going in my tote bag. I got this from pa uh, Powerland, I wish it was. I got it from Primark. And it's actually really, really nice. So yeah. That's pretty much it. The only other things we need to get still is juice, snacks, bottles. <laughs> so yeah, just juice, snacks, bottles, things like that. And then we will, we're taking two separate buggies. Um, I'll say they're three and four, and a lot of people don't take buggies for three and four yards, but I've got bad hits. Jack's broke his skirt. Come on. 
I've got a bad foot, Jack's broke his, I've got bad hips, Jack's broke his foot, um, and we don't really stay in the resort a lot. We are self-catering this time as well, so we will be Hello. going out of the resort quite Hello. a lot. And the strip Hello. is quite a far way away. So it's mainly just for night time, especially if we've got a night time and they fall asleep. Um, I got, I got we normally take the double buggy, but we're flying with Jet 2 this time, and I read on their things that if the buggy's over 10 kg, then you have to pay. And our buggy definitely is because it's a double buggy and it's heavy. So yeah, that is everything. That is everything for this video. I've got a dog that also wants to play with me. Lost the plot. Oh, can we put you up? Alright, yeah, that's everything. So I shall see you later.